Hello everyone, Attack Power here with an extremely exciting video. My first video as a Strike Team member trying out the new divisions here from Normandy 44. I'm up against Protoss here. He is playing 7th Armor Desert Rats and I am playing 1st SS Panzer Lassar here. So uh, I decided to like start the recording here while setting up so of course I can show you guys new units and all that kind of stuff. Uh, we're on Orsha East here. I don't know if this will actually be a good matchup or a good map for this division at all. Technically, my CQC is kind of very underwhelming, but these yellow forests and stuff should do pretty well for me, and this town fighting might do pretty well, too. So we'll see if we can get past A phase. I think A phase is my weakest time, really. Um, all right, so recon-wise, I just brought these Panzergren Lasas here. No, like, off or anything, because I have two cards of these dudes who are basically, uh, like, small versions of... Uh, Panzergrens here. We have no MG42s. Decided to go with the IG18s and stuff instead. Already regretting that, not having like an MG42 for right here. His division's definitely going to be much faster than mine, so that's going to be a problem. Also, I'm not really going to have that much of an advantage in the open because he's got 17 pounders and fireflies and Achilles and basically more 2K than me. <laughs> when it really comes down to it. He's got more 2K than I do. So. I don't actually know if fighting out in the open is going to be the best. His infantry are all battle-weary and stuff, which means they should uh, like get disheartened faster. Um, so hopefully infantry fight should go really well for me. We'll have to see how that Bren buff feels. Uh, the other strike team members have told me it's not as crazy as it first appears on paper. We'll, well, we'll see about that. Not so sure, but what do I know, I guess? I'm new to this. So, yeah, should be exciting. So we have Pack 38s, the, all the Lassau infantry. There's nothing special about, like, the Pandershrek Lassau. And I'm saying Lassau. I'm not saying L-S-S-H-H every overtime. I'm sure we can all sure we can all appreciate why I'm doing that. Uh, the nice thing, the Pioneer, the Panzer Pioneer Lassau here have double MG-42. They're basically a Panzergren with a grenade. That's what these guys really are, which is pretty sick. The problem is I still don't ever really want them in CQC fighting. So that's, that's the weird thing, because really they're Panzergrens. Like, at the end of the day, that's what they are. So it's like a weird... It's just a weird... They're weird units. So we're going to try to get up here onto this hill successfully. We do have Pumas. Got to remember that. Really important to keep that in mind. Um, hmm. Pumas are now 50 points, but they also come with the APCR. We also technically have higher availability, so we have more, uh, you know, more more of them at higher veterancy as well. Uh, these are the new Panzergren Lassas with four rifles, four G43s, and two MG42s. No AT on those, though. I got very little, late, very little AT. The other Panzergren unit has AT on it, like a Panzerfaust, but the thing was, it just felt like such a, I don't know, it felt like such a downgrade from these guys. Like, these guys are a more chonky squad with better rifles and stuff. I had a hard time picking a weaker squad just because they had a Panzerfaust, which comes up, but doesn't come up like an absurd amount of the time. I'm not always like, God, I wish every unit had a Panzerfaust. Uh, you can survive just fine without it. You got plenty of Volkdusche here. Get our leader in. Of course, we're going to get a Puma here. Okay, of course, I still have no machine guns to work with. <laughs> Not my best plan, probably. Let's just do go one flamer. What about here? We're going to go IG-18. I'm actually going to deploy him here and have him deploy out like that. Or maybe I should go further. Yeah, actually, let's go all the way over here. Nope, I want this guy. Need a few. Sorry. Do we give this up? That's the question. I don't think his CQC is actually all that good. That's that's the one thing here that I have to keep in mind. Is I don't actually think his CQC is very good. So I could probably fight him close range successfully. I probably don't have to like full on give up every woods to him. Oh, I got the shakes going. I don't know why. It's really annoying. All right, there we go. I'm thinking IG-18 here. Hmm. 
All right, so send our two flamethrowers over here. The problem is my really good yellow forest guys don't come till B phase. Like these guys who are actually disgustingly good at yellow forest don't come till B phase, which really sucks. I think we just send a whole bunch of pioneer, which again are essentially pantagrens. Problem is too, he's got a tempest. So like at any point he could just fly that thing in, bomb whatever I have, and that would be the end of everything. Because no AA is going to stop that like by itself. Maybe an SDK of Z71. Maybe, but that's about it. Let's go Puma over here. Um, I mean, clearly I need more Pumas. I'm thinking... No, let's just do a Volkdorsche. Over here. 20 points, 20 points, 20 points. I could send a leader somewhere, or we go for an early Panzer Shrek. I'm not usually a fan of this play, but knowing how many, like, light armor units he has, I think it might be worth doing this. None of these infantry have AT over here. That's kind of terrifying, actually. Hmm. Nah, this is probably fine. Ready? Good luck. Have fun. All right. Let's see if Protoss smacks me around or not. See how out of shape attack power is. I should do all right. I think I play more than him. He's much more of a Warno guy these days. Not that there's anything wrong with that. All right. Let's turn off the APCR. There's nothing early game that I need to kill with APCR. Like later, of course, you know, being able to take out Shermans or something a little more consistently, you know, definitely might turn on, turn on APCR for that. But for transport killing and his armored car killing, absolutely do not need the APCR on. Why does this feel really fast? Are these SDK of Zeds faster than normal? I don't remember them ever moving that fast. Do the recon ones just move faster? Is that what it is? He definitely has Jeeps, so there's no way I beat him to the front line. Although... God, if, it, if I'm not beating him to the front line. It seems impossible. Okay, good to note that these move really fast. I, I'm, I don't think that's new. I just feel like maybe I didn't know it. Yeah, I absolutely do not want you in this fight. Oh, that's not good. Uh oh, that's what I really did not want. Let's spread these out a bunch. Let's get a Panzer Shrek. Let's get a Panzer Four. Oh, that's not good. Who wins this? It would appear me, maybe. Ah, I was backing up too. Got a gun jam on that thing. It's not amazing or anything, but something. Let's see if we can get some more Volkdeutsche in. Hey, that's not great, but we're not dead, so there's a plus. All right, we got this. That's wonderful. Wunderbar. Let's move this guy over to here. Volkdeutsche this way. Yeah, see, like, his, his CQC is not actually any better than mine at the end of the day. Oh, uh, let's get a Panzer IV up here. This does run into this issue now that I don't have any CQC either. Yeah, these should be easy wins. Like, my long-range fighting power is so much higher than his, it's kind of hilarious. Let's move this guy up. Oh, uh, here we go. I actually lost sight of that for a second. Seems kind of crazy. So these are, yeah, they have battle weary, yeah. Oh, didn't see that. Oopsie daisy. Let's 
All right, so if he's going to do stuff like that, then we're just going to... IG-18 dead. Oof. Cromwell's. Ugh. All right, easy to uh, defense there. Hardy wise all right. Yeah, this ain't great, naturally. Let's move him over, Let's spot what's going on here. We're gonna want some anti-air. I could, is this enough, really? I guess. Oh my. Oh my. Uh, let's get, no, let's get some Volk Deutsche. There's a freebie. Sweet. Ah! Oh, and also remember, the fallback changes have applied to this, this match, so... We are seeing the full fallback change here as well. Some AA coming in. That's a shame. Waste of a unit there. But cannon, cannon angle too high. I'm calling some major baloney sugar on that. Let's get a mortar. I'm seeing a lot of places around the map where a mortar would be very helpful. Uh, I'm going to have to deal with this the whole game, aren't I? Chromo 6s are the HEs, yeah. He definitely does not have a leader here. There we go. What a perfect spot. What a legitimately perfect spot. No, don't shoot! I actually want them to be recon. Okay, he got in there. That's annoying. All right, we got all this locked down pretty good. Mortar is here. Oh, come on. Yeah. Awkward. No AT. <laughs> punished. Hardcore punished. And he took out this Flammerwerfer, which was like kind of holding it all together for me, actually. Some kind of cannon here. Yeah, six pounder. Wow, wrecked him. I'd prefer not to lose this. I'm going to lose this. Oh, wow. Didn't lose it. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Actually, let's go this way. No. Screw you, Crusader AA. Suck a nut. I want to get closer so this guy can... Nice. Oh, wow. IG-18 laying a hate round. Look at you go. No, that one bounced. I can see that. 
All right, sick. All right, you, I don't need this here now, technically. He was coming here for that specific reason, but now he does not need it. I mean, the division's feeling good so far. It doesn't feel like anything nutso potato. Like, the new, new units don't feel crazy strong or anything. Where's it coming? Oh, over there. But yeah, he still took a good bit of damage. So that's that's big. That's that fallback change. Come on. Again. Rose getting aggressive. Yeah, he still died. All right, that fallback change very real. Do I still lose this? Nice. Uh, that's a shame. I wasn't paying attention, so I deserve it, but that's a bummer. Is he going to air bully me? Protoss was always an air bullier. Uh, problem is I can't move... I can't do this until I clear off this hill. Yeah, he's moving into there. Alright, well that's extremely annoying already. You can go over here with it. I would love to kill that. I really would have liked that not to pen, but it did. Come on, come on, come on. No. Is he ground attacking? Seriously? Promo dead over there. That's good. Just on freaking load, please. Well, we're obviously going to need some more. Thanks, yeah. Nice. Oh, come on. Really? <laughs> really, we're doing this? Wow. All I have to say is wow. Now he's got some big A artillery coming down. I think you for uh, for content's sake I got to get this out soon. Next tick. Luckily he hit the weakened one, so not a huge deal. These guys should actually be really good here. 
love if that took that down. I know it's not going to. Return fire on you. Why don't you get up here? He's obviously pushing something up here. Uh, let's actually... Yeah, let's get this guy here and we're going to walk him over to the other side of the area here. Oh my god. Yes, please god kill this thing. Oh, come on. Please, thank you. There, Ode. I feel better. I feel much better now. Ah, uh, I need to get some of these guys over here. These are the ones. All right. Some mortar on that. Love that for me. All right. And the Flakverling survived. Double love that for me. Stug three now in position. Watch And you missed. Wow, he really doesn't like my recon being here. Really, he really hates that. There, that's how it should be. Some bouncy wouncies all. Oh, come on. There we go. Nice. Aw. Maybe one more? That's the whole point of these, really? I got recon everywhere. Push him around. Let's push him in. I'm going to get a second. Y'all know how I feel about Artie in this game. One is nothing. Two is everything. All right. Got a pretty good setup going here. Let's see if we can get an attack marker on one of these. Well, that's a firefly. That is not a, uh, that's not a small tank. I thought it was just HE for a second. Nice. Notice they're still taking damage as they fall back. It's such a nice change to see. Like, it really is. Okay, I really didn't want you to go back in. Like, at all. I'm gonna let him go cheat off some of that ammo. It's right there before I lose the thingamajigger. Let's just unload this. Let's get our shot off. Then you queue up and they'll get back in. All right, now. I got my legit guys now. Let's get one more over here and I'm actually gonna call in a Flaxwilling Flax over here as well. In a pretty, eh. the more obvious you make it to see, the easier it is to uh, actually get on target earlier. Oh, see, a little late. I'm late. Does he miss? No, not at all. I'll be killing you now. Thank you. That should have wiped out anything that was here. I just saw something blow up. So yeah, we killed something right there. Seemed pretty sick, not gonna lie. He's definitely got some sort of recon, most likely in this hill here. There it is. Where 
Where are you hiding? Wow, you're like right on the road. Okay. Good enough. So got the thirteen eleven. That's all I really need. Should be an easy kill, I would think. Nice. I knew that was coming right on him. <laughs> I had no doubt in my mind. I don't, obviously, I don't want to fight a fight where he's got armored support and I don't. There we go. Nice. Let's get in there. My infantry aren't amazing at CQC, but they're better than his at this point. Stug, let's go. Stuggy boogie. Hiya! Oh my god. Why do you hate me game so frickin' much? Like, actually, what is your passionate hatred of me for? What have I done to you other than love you? More than you deserve to be loved. Wow, he has so much recon. It's right there. Shug 3 dead. Okay. Another firefly. Let's get this on the hill here. Black Verling out in the open, no big deal. Uh, I specifically brought all this A in for that purpose, but you know, whatevs. I mean, he's not getting any further. The problem is I can't see how effective that really is. We'll probably have to, I'll probably have to check the replay to like really see. Come on, load up. Annoying me. Stop it. Thank you. Yes. Oh, killing those is a GD miracle. All right, so we're gonna get a panther here. Sure. Yeah, no, I don't think so, dude. Ugh, arty, 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 arty. The nice thing is you do get a lot of these Sturm Pioneers. <laughs> he pinned his own guy down. Love it. Please, don't shoot. Nice. And I definitely, I'm pretty confident I have more of mine than he has of his. I'm fine to use APCR on this one. Uh, nope, there's nothing there. I don't want APCR for this. Uh, I say let's go for it. Thank you. So very much. Come on. That spotter is still alive. Love that for me. Black reeling. Oh, come on, dude. Wow, he still somehow got a shot off. Of course he did. Can we can we now? Nope. I'm not sure how he keeps threading the needle <laughs> on that. It's driving me nuts. Let's hit this. And let's hit. Rifle's dead. That's glorious. 
Now he's backed up. Yeah, he's in like a, he's pinched. I got him pinched. Nice. Yeah, so now I got the finishing blow here with the pack 38. Now how fast is this thing eating up ammo? Eh, relatively fast. Yeah, let's get a pack 40 here. And this is my issue with uh, Axis half tracks. They just don't do enough to feel like you can really do stuff with them. Right, seriously. Oh, pack 40. <laughs> you've, you've made me so sad today. Pack 38, I appreciate you trying. Oh, oh my. Well, I know where the next shot's going. Right there. You need to move. You need to move immediately. Can you please frickin' move? Just anywhere. Black for Ling, thank you. Cut across here, we know he has guys in there. Get there, let's finish off our Volk Deutsche here. Yes, nice. I know I've been out trading him, I have no doubt of that. Okay, Zed dead. My pack 40, are you kidding me right now? Oh my god. You gotta be kidding me. I'm assuming there's something here. We're gonna double Panzer IV over here. Let's get a Panzer IV on this side. 15-9, love that for me. I see you. Who's reloaded? Let's see if we can one-shot that. I keep thinking there's six rounds in this. There's only five. Really gotta get used to that. Go, Panther, go. Let's get two more. So, scout spam? Oh. Come on, Panther. Ah! No, no chance. Nice. Good clear. Let's back this guy up, knowing that there's still probably a scout here. Good. Another Firefly dead. Nice! All right. Very nice. Did I move this? I, I don't know. The Cromwell dead. Love that for me. Yeah, you better run, Firefly. Oh, nice. Wrecking it. All right, yeah, we need the double tick now is killing him. Just move things slightly. We don't have to go nuts. Fine. I don't want the head on, but we're going to do it anyway in the hope that then we shoot it down. Yeah, we will with the flak merling. Come on. Thank you. All right. Just got a chip. Oh, lost tank. Just got to keep taking chips at his... Uh, Probably still quite formidable Air Force here. How much supply we got? Plenty. Excellent, excellent. And the GG, GG's. I mean, so the, the real question is how, how did first Panzer feel? It, it feels good. I mean, it felt very well rounded. I didn't feel like I was missing any tools at all. I mean, honestly, even the CQC didn't feel bad. But the, the truth of the matter is, is 7th does not have great CQC, right? So, like, if I'm really coming up against a real CQC division, I'm, 
I do not feel comfortable going into the woods, right? Those Sturm Pioneer squads, while they are really good in yellow forest and serviceable in green, do not feel like, oh, I'm, I'm slapping here in the woods at all. Um, they're definitely better, like, technically speaking, they are worse than your average Sturm Pioneer squad in, in the green woods. But they are far more flexible and have a lot more other uses for them. Wow, look at that. These Nebelor for 210s feel pretty dope. I'm not going to lie. I didn't actually see what they killed, but like we can see that they it got a kill by itself here really well. Um, obviously, this thing picked up a lot of kills here. I think two of these slap really hard. I mean, it's a Nebelwerfer with, with what, 60 millimeters more destruction on it. So hard to say that's bad. This division feels very good. I, it doesn't feel OP, though. I will say that. Like, I didn't feel like the Grenadiers are better, but not like, whoa, out of control better. They're just a step up. Um, I, it's a cool division. It's got a little bit of flavor to it. It's unique that way. But otherwise, I mean, it's basically just a Panzer division. Like, when, it really, when you really boil it down, it's a Panzer division. I think a little bit better than your average one, for sure. Do I think it makes all other Panzer divisions bad? No, definitely not. Uh, but... Is it good? Absolutely. I think this is a very solid, probably A tier, uh, you know, bottom ish of A tier Panzer division uh, with the usual weaknesses and some of the strengths, you know, in some better strengths there. If you guys enjoyed this, make sure to hit that like button, subscribe, and consider checking out the Patreon link down below and attackpowergaming.com. Thanks a bunch, guys, and have a fantastic day.